Some things in life are just made to go together. Peanut butter and jelly, rock and roll, the sun and the moon. These things got Blake Sanders, the owner of KS Services, thinking. What can we pair with our superior heating and air service to make our customers even happier? Plumbing Experts by KS Services was born. So the next time you have a clogged line, leaky faucet, or water running all through the house, know there's a reputable company out there on call just a click away. Call KS.com, your trusted source for heating and cooling and now plumbing. Good morning, this is the Weather Extreme video for Sunday morning, June 2nd, 2019. While most stay dry and hot throughout the day today, a few lucky locations may see an isolated shower. For those who need rain, your luck is about to change as the end of the work week and next weekend looks to be wet at times. More on that in just a moment. As of 6 a.m. this morning, we have a good bit of clear skies across central Alabama, but we do have a few clouds streaming in from the west that may dim the sunrise for some for just a little bit. Temperatures across the area were in the upper 50s to the mid-60s. A few locations were tied at 66 degrees as the warm spots, while we have a few tied at 59 degrees as the cool spots. Birmingham was at 65 degrees. It is only the second day of the 2019 Atlantic hur hurricane season, and we already have an area of concern over the southern parts of the Bay of Campeche. Movement will be to the west-northwest and has a 60% chance of becoming a depression before moving inland over Mexico early next week. No threat to the U.S. mainland, and the rest of the tropics are quiet at this time. Now let's get to the forecast for central Alabama for today and through the rest of the first week of June. We are starting off the morning hours with a cold front off to our north that will eventually sweep through central Alabama later this evening and through the overnight hours. While we have a good bit of dry air in place, there may be just enough for a few isolated showers and thunderstorms over the north and northeastern parts of the area during the afternoon, including the cities of Jasper, Birmingham, Coleman, Gadsden, and Anniston. The chance of any one spot getting rain in those locations is roughly around 20%. Locations south and west of those will stay dry with mostly clear skies. Highs will be in the lower to mid 90s across the area. For tonight, we'll have diminishing rain chances in the northeast during the evening and back to dry conditions with partly cloudy skies throughout the late night and overnight hours. Lows will be in the mid 60s to the lower 70s. On Monday, the cold front will be down to our south, and some of us will be lucky enough to have slightly cooler temperatures, especially over the northern parts of the area. Skies will be mostly sunny, with highs reaching the mid-80s to the mid-90s across the area from north to south. On Tuesday, we'll have some clouds moving in from the west as a low starts to build over the Colorado-New Mexico border. We'll stay dry for one more day with mostly clear to partly cloudy skies and highs in the upper 80s to the lower 90s. We'll start to get more of a southwesterly flow across the area on Wednesday that will pull more moisture up into the area from the Gulf. With the heating of the day, we'll have a small chance of a few isolated to scattered showers and thunderstorms across the area. Afternoon highs will be in the upper 80s to the lower 90s. The trough and low pressure move closer to the area on Thursday, and our chances for scattered showers and thunderstorms will increase for the day. We'll start off with rain chances in the 30 to 50 percent range from east to west during the daytime and increasing to 40 to 60 percent by the evening and late night hours. While some sun is possible, I don't expect we'll see much of it. Highs will be in the mid 80s to the lower 90s. Showers and thunderstorms will become likely on Friday as we continue to see the system move slowly to the east. With the rainfall and cloud cover across central Alabama, highs should stay in the mid to upper 80s. Showers and thunderstorms continue to look likely throughout next weekend as we continue to stay in an unsettled weather pattern. While a few peaks of sunshine is possible, it will be a gray weekend. Highs will remain in the mid to upper 80s on both days. After that, it looks like we'll have a chance of rain on each day with our next completely dry day possible coming on Monday, June the 10th. That is all for your Weather Extreme video for today. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. The next video will be out bright and early on Monday morning, produced by James Spann. This is Scott Martin signing off for today. Have a great day, and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. 
tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call plumbing experts today.